Today, if you're a Baltimore Raven fan, you gotta thank, I think, Dennis Pita for everything that he did within the tight end position for the Baltimore Ravens. He was released. It's hard to stay healthy in any sport. Strong couple seasons that he had. Uh, obviously, I don't think he's ready to call it a career. If I was him, I hope he does. Coming off a of third hip surgery now. He got injured last week, from what I understand. You're a Raven fan. You gotta hope that uh, Burns and Ryan Malik could uh, step up and uh, replace, you know, Dennis Pita in some sort of capacity between the both of them. Been to Baltimore. A lot of Pita jerseys out there. So the guy is beloved. Uh, his whole career is with the uh, with the Ravens. Unlucky. I mean, injuries. Too many injuries. I just remember games against the Browns. He was just a, a nightmare. Uh, he led tie all tight ends in catches last season so he had a he had a good year it just happens again that he gets bit with the injury bug uh 2016 86 catches 2015 did not play injury 2014 uh 16 three games he played in 2013 uh, 2014 played in three games 2013 played in four games 20 receptions 2012, 16 games, 61 receptions. 2011, uh, 16 games, 40 receptions. 2010, 11 games, one reception. So you could see that, you know, obviously his best year was 2016 and uh, now another injury and, and there you go. Uh, so it's a shame. Um, it's a shame, uh, but Maybe if you're a Raven fan, you're thinking, all right, same that shame that the guy gets released. Maybe. Maybe this opens up cap space for Decker. Lessen the blow a little bit for you guys. I don't know, but um, it's a shame. It's a shame, just unlucky. If you're a Raven fan, you got to thank him. If you're an NFL fan, you got to thank him for everything that he did. Hope all is well.